What's up guys, Mr. Jerko here. Welcome back to the kingdom. Uh, so today I got first place, as you see in front, with Prank Kids. Uh, I faced round one with Solomon Gray, uh, two old that, uh, Infernoid two one, yep. and uh, <laughs> Karibo round three, uh, two one I believe. Yeah, no two zero. Yeah, it's two zero. So yeah, only the one that got me trouble was the uh, Infernoid matchup because he opened Super Poly twice, and just Nibiru. Yeah, Nibiru killed me in Super Poly. So it was like Nibiru first and Super Poly. So. Uh, all in all, uh, the deck was really good. Meow Meow does put in work. Uh, very much. Big brain. Uh, yeah, I won against Profile last week, but my, again, like I said, my tripod broke, so, um, yeah, anyway, let's go ahead and get Profile. I want to do this for a while. So, pretty much standard. Um, this is also going to get posted to the uh, Prank Kids uh, Facebook page, so hopefully I, I get critiqued on that. So, yeah. Uh, so, first off, play max of all Prank Kids. Uh, three wind, three water, three fire, three earth. Uh, water is a foolish burial to summon a guy that's not wind. Uh, blue is you gain a thousand life, especially a guy that's not blue. Uh, fire is you... Burn your opponent for five and special summon that's not fire. And then Earth is you banish a card from your hand, draw one, and then summon one that's not Earth. So, yeah, that's literally it. Uh, they're all good. You have to max out on them to get the one card um, card plays. Uh, this is technically going second, so uh, Pranky Tops. I opted to run two Ghost Ogre um, because it's one of the better hand traps I thought about Baylor, but I think Ghost Ogre is kind of better all around. And then three Ash, of course, because it's Ash and it's one of the better hand traps. Uh, ashing generator boss stage during my turn, opponent's turn in my turn, really good. Uh, staples, uh, Feather Duster, Call by the Grave, Terraforming, and Instant Fusion, um, all good one-ofs, uh, even Call by the Grave. Um, still with the one card starter uh, with this and uh, uh, place. And then just board wipe, and then this is a recovery play. Um, if you draw a late game, it's godly, so. Uh, should be banned, but it's not. Uh, two desires. I was running three in one of my previous builds three weeks ago, but I cut it down to two because I just figured it wasn't that much of a brick. Sometimes, but not all the time. Uh, I still opted to run three super, or not super early, but uh, super rare super, uh, polymerization. Uh, it's just a good, just generic uh, fusion spell without with pandemonium. You have you're locked into prank kids, but with this you're not. So uh, very, like I said, big brain stuff. Uh, opted to run three cosmic cyclone as well. I didn't have enough back row hate with just the happy uh, uh, feather duster, so just uh, beating one uh, face down or a field spell, whatever. Um, you're not really worried about life because you gain life back, so um, it's just free free removal. So, And, yeah, people didn't really see it coming. Uh, for the prank kids, I got one uh, pranks. I kind of uh, wanted to run two. I still think so. I think that's the right number. Um, but one worked out well. Uh, two pla uh, pandemonium. And then three place. I opted to run three place because, again, like I said, terraforming into place into one card starter. You have three, six, nine, twelve starters. Um, 15, 16, so yeah, it's just all one card starters as long as you don't get into be rude. Uh, one plan, I still run the one plan because it's um, good to add if you have nothing else or just the banish to uh, 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 what I'm trying to say, goddamn, decrease your opponent's monster's attack. So, and then um, triple imperm because it's a good trap. Dude, That's the main deck. Uh, extra deck. It's all right. I had to change it up because there's no Dogmatica, so it's more of a casual tournament. Uh, three Meow Meow. It's really good. Uh, it counts as a tribute cost for any of your uh, prank kids during your opponent's or your turn, depending on what you have. So uh, it puts in work because it leaves the body on field, plus you get the added bonus. So um, One Bow Wow and two Doodle. So I thought about running one doodle and two bow wow because I wanted to go more aggressive with the deck. So with the pranks, I can just shuffle back the one doodle and keep the second bow wow to uh, still boost up. So that was kind of my theory, but two doodle and one bow wow was fine. Uh, one rip roaring roaster because that's like a Harvey's feather duster. I didn't really make it, but it's there just to, for back row decks. Uh, fusions, one butler, the regeki, uh, not once per turn. <laughs> uh, two, or one weather watcher and two ride. Uh, rocket ride is really good just for the first turn. And this is going for, um, setting up for next turn for your opponent, so. Um, 
Oh, I guess I should mention. Um, adds a spell of trap and crank a spell of trap. Uh, and adds uh, s uh, cards during your opponent's turn. Uh, tribute to special two prank kids that are not fusions from your graveyard. And then during your opponent's turn, do the same. And like I said with the other one, it's a Regeki. Um, one of best dollar because two level fours make it. Uh, and then my rank or link fours were Boral Sword originally, Topologic Bomb, Zerbos, and Borla Dragon. Uh, I was playing Avermax in, uh, for this, but me and the uh, last round guy made a gentleman's agreement that I wouldn't run it because uh, Avermax battles suck. So I did this and am glad I went with this because Desires in this is just a bunch of damage. And then last but not least, um, for the side, uh, sta kind of standard, three Lancia. Uh, Inferno matchup was good. Um, this against Salmon Great and Kribo. I didn't see it against Salmon Great, but Kribo was fine. Um, only out to Avermax was the droplet. Uh, evenly matched was good against the salad matchup. And then I didn't bother side, um, but taking these out. These are technically for Dogmatica, but uh, I didn't really care too much to take them out. The 12 um, cards in the side were good. So, uh, yeah, that's the deck. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment, subscribe. Um, uh, like I said, I'll be posting this to the Prank Kids uh, Facebook page to get more insight of what they think. Um, yeah, so comment, subscribe. And catch you guys later with the kingdom.